Hi everyone! Technology has improved leaps and bounds in the last 10 years. It used to be the case that if you wanted to reduce any fine lines, wrinkles, pigmentation, skin texture, you had to visit a clinic, buy a very expensive course of treatments, go there week in, week out to get any sort of significant results. It was incredibly pricey and although those treatments still exist and you are going to get better results, you're going to see them slightly faster with in-house clinics than you are with at-home devices. I much prefer an at-home device because once I've bought it, it is mine to keep and I can continuously use it over time and also fit it into my busy lifestyle as and when I see fit. So my mum and I have been testing so many amazing anti-aging at home devices over the last 18 or so months and I thought it would be a really good idea to collate all that information and shove it into one video. So if you are thinking of investing in an anti-aging at home device, hopefully this video will answer all of the questions that you have. So let's get on with it. So if you're new here, hi, my name's Gemma. I'm actually a qualified esthetician and beauty therapist here in the UK. UK, but I no longer work in a clinic as my full-time job is now YouTube. I would absolutely love it if at some point in this video, if you are finding it helpful, please consider coming and joining the Pampered Wolf Pack by clicking on that like button, the subscribe button and the notification bell. So before I jump into the first product, I'd just like to thank Current Body for part sponsoring this video today. I seriously appreciate it. I've worked with Current Body numerous times in the past. They are an amazing company that sell a lot of at-home devices and also other products as well. So if you are thinking of investing in any of the pieces of kit that I'm going to be talking about in this video today, I will link all the products in the description box below for you. And I'll also link the Current Body website, which I definitely recommend that you check out. So we're going to work through four different categories. The first category is for those wanting face sculpting and toning and an increase in skin clarity. The second one is for those wanting to decrease pigmentation and scarring. The third one is for those wanting to decrease fine lines and wrinkles. And the fourth one is multi-purpose. It has a lot of those benefits combined into one product. The first product in the face sculpting, toning and skin clarity category is a relatively inexpensive one. I'm talking about the Gua Sha. So the Gua Sha originated in Southeast Asia. It was originally a healing technique device and translated Gua Sha means scrape away illnesses. It's a smooth device that's often made of jade or quartz and it's designed to gently sweep over the skin and sculpt the face, neck and body. By doing specific movements with the Gua Sha using gentle pressure, you can increase blood flow and circulation, giving you clearer skin over time and give you that refreshed, healthy, flushed glow. It also aids lymphatic drainage, primarily reducing puffiness and inflammation, but also reducing toxins. And by reducing facial excess fluid, the face looks more toned and lifted. It can also release facial tension, which is something that I find incredibly soothing. By releasing the facial tension, it smooths the wrinkles and increases the firmness. The treatment takes between three and five minutes. I like to use a facial oil to make sure that it's gliding across the skin rather than tugging the skin and I repeat each movement five times. You can do Gua Sha at any time of day. I do think it's probably going to be most beneficial for most people at least. First thing in the morning when our skin is slightly puffier so that the Gua Sha can de-puff the skin. Three times a week is what I would definitely recommend that you do, but you can do it daily and you can also do it morning and night. There is zero pain with this treatment whatsoever. You see results pretty much immediately with the whole face sculpting and a lifting. However, you will see better skin quality over a number of weeks. With regards to the face sculpting and lifting effects, unfortunately, this is one of those treatments that you are going to have to continuously perform on a week by week basis in order to keep those results. The side effects to Gua Sha are pretty minimal. I will say though, you may experience some form of skin purging in the first couple of weeks. Please don't let that put you off though. The dirt is already in the pore. It's just making its way to the surface. It's a little bit like when you stand in a river and start to walk. The walking process, the movement, stirs up the dirt from the bottom of the riverbed. So that's exactly what you're doing with Gua Sha. It's just coming to the surface and you're getting rid of it, which is a really good thing. 
Gua Sha is an inexpensive investment, the typical Gua Sha tool, around five to ten pounds. Gua Sha is best for those people who don't want to spend a massive amount of money but want to see visible results, want to depuff swollen heavy skin and increase skin clarity giving them that youthful glow and decreasing breakouts over time. For me, there are zero negatives to Gua Sha. It's inexpensive, it's pain-free, it's really relaxing. You just need to dedicate a little bit of time to it. The main thing I will say with Gua Sha is have realistic expectations. It's not a miracle worker and the results that you see after doing it are going to fade. So you are gonna have to keep it up. The next product I want to talk about is the Beauty Bar Facial Massager. This is for those people that really struggle holding the Gua Sha tool because it can be pretty difficult. And also, even though the Gua Sha comes in lots of different shapes and sizes, sometimes it can be different not only holding the device, but also really cupping and sculpting the contours of the face because everybody's face shape is completely different. This is where I would recommend this tool. So this is a vibrating facial massager. It will do similar things to the Gua Sha. The treatment takes between three and five minutes every day if possible. Again, in the morning, if you do get puffiness in the morning, I use an oil. You can use a cream or a serum as long as the massager glides over the skin without tugging. There is no pain whatsoever and the vibration, again, is incredibly relaxing and the metal on the device can actually be really cooling on the skin as well. You see results pretty much immediately that glow, a slight lifted, more sculpted look to the face and again better skin quality over time. As with the Gua Sha you will lose the results if you stop doing the treatments altogether. Skin purging is also a possible side effect with the treatment. It's around about £16 to buy the device so again pretty inexpensive and it's best for people who want to depuff swollen skin and really aid that lymphatic drainage. The negatives for me is that it takes an AA battery so it's not as cost effective as the Gua Sha. It's also not as environmentally friendly as the Gua Sha but uh, I'm really struggling to find any other negatives. Let's move on to the new face. You all knew it was going to feature in this video at some point. So the new face is a wireless gym workout for the face. It gives you that lifted, sculpted, more snatched appearance. The microcurrent within the device mimics the bioelectricity in your body which energizes skin cells in your muscles, making them tighter and smoother and more lifted and aiding toxin removal and also gives you that collagen and elastin boost. Over time with continuous use you will see fresher, tighter and healthier skin and it also has the ability to lift eyebrows and hooded eyes. The treatments take between 5 minutes for the basic routine, 20 minutes for the full routine and you should be doing this 5 days a week for your first 2 months and then 3 sessions a week after that for maintenance. There's no pain with the new face whatsoever, it does give a little bit of a tingling sensation, some people say that feels a little bit like pins and needles. You will see some subtle results immediately, but you will get better results over time. And after three months, you may see pore minimization and also better skin elasticity. This is another one of those devices that if you stop using it, you will lose the results. And if my mum goes on holiday and doesn't take this device with her, she will know a difference when she returns back. Side effects, some people say that this leaves a metallic taste in your mouth, but I haven't heard of any other side effects to mention. I know my mum hasn't had any. The price of this is around about £300, but there are a lot of offers to be had, so I would never ever buy this at full price. Always check the discount codes and I will make sure I put them in the description box for you. This is suitable for all skin types. I would say that this device is more suited to anybody who want the effects of the Gua Sha and the facial massager tool, but want to give it a little bit more welly. Those electronic pulses really amp up the effects. The negatives for this, well, obviously the initial outlay of this is expensive, so that is a major negative. You also have to buy specific gels to use with this device. So 
you do need a conductive gel. You don't need to use the New Face branded gels, you can use a regular ultrasound gel with the New Face which are relatively inexpensive, you can buy them in bulk on Amazon and they'll last you an absolute lifetime. Like with any piece of equipment, if you have a pre-existing medical condition you should always consult your doctor to make sure that the New Face is appropriate for you to be using. Let's move on to the last product in the face sculpting and lifting category. This is the Zip and this has completely blown the new face out of the water for my mum. She says this is the new face on steroids. She loves this device. Unfortunately, like I said earlier, my mum is on holiday at the moment. She's taken the zip with her, so I don't have it to show you. I also don't have her routine to hand to show you her routine. However, this is a product that comes with an app and there are so many different routines that you can do. You just follow the app and the directions on the app every single day. So this is one of those pieces of equipment that you don't get bored doing the same routine day in, day out. So again, this is a wireless microcurrent device, but it also uses nano current to give it that little bit of extra boost. In my mum's opinion, this feels more powerful than the new face and her results from the zip last longer than the results that she got when she used to use her new face device. Those results will give you contouring, lifting and sculpting and shaping of the face. It will also help to depuff and define your bone structure. It comes with an app, so it's numerous routines so you never get bored. And these range from five minutes to 30 minutes minutes per treatment. You need to be doing this three to six times per week and the results last 48 to 72 hours as opposed to the new faces 12 to 24 hours. There's no pain with this device whatsoever. Some may feel a slight tingling, some might feel nothing at all. And you should see immediate results with this and increased results over time. As with all of the other products within this category, continuous use of the device is required so that you don't lose the results that you already have. Again, just like with the new face, some might get a slight metallic taste in the mouth and it is quite pricey at just over £400. But again, look out for those offers. The zip is going to suit those people that one, get bored with doing the same routine time and time again, day in, day out, because you don't need to do that with the zip but also those people that want those immediate results and want those effects to last for a significant amount of time longer than is usual with these sorts of devices. The negatives, obviously the price is going to be a massive negative for a lot of people. At just over £400, it is an expensive piece of equipment. You also need to buy a specific gel to use with the zip. You can't use a usual ultrasound gel that you can use with the new face because of the nano current that's within the zip. Again, if you have any health issues, please consult your doctor before buying this device. Let's move on to the category for the decrease in pigmentation and scarring. I suffer with scarring on my skin from acne scarring and I know how completely it can destroy your self-confidence and your self-esteem. So let's go into the one treatment that I definitely recommend if you do have a lot of pigmentation issues or scarring on your skin that you want to decrease and you want to decrease them quite significantly. This is the Dr. Pen Ultima M8 Wireless Microneedling Pen Kit and this one comes with 10 disposable cartridges, one cartridge per use. This is an electrical device that has needles which penetrate the skin to various programmable depths in the treatable areas of the face and the body. This will even the skin tone, decreasing pigmentation, decreasing scarring and rejuvenate the complexion. If you use the needles to penetrate the skin at certain depths, this can accelerate collagen and elastin production, in turn decreasing fine lines and wrinkles and also smoothing out skin texture. This can 
can also increase skincare absorption depth. So if you want your skincare to get a little deeper in the skin, doing that straight after this procedure will really aid that. Although I wouldn't apply anything too aggressive to the skin because you have just punctured a lot of holes in the surface of your skin. So anything that goes on the skin after that needs to be really gentle. The treatment lasts between two and five minutes and you can do this once a week for low needle depths or if you're doing anything 0.5 millimeters or above every three to six weeks to be safe. It can take three to six months of doing the treatment every three to six weeks before you start seeing any results. However, my results were quite significant. Again, everybody's results are going to be different. The pain is going to differ from person to person. I feel like it's a little pinch on the skin, but some people find it incredibly painful. So if you're doing this at home and you're wanting to penetrate the skin with the needles quite deeply, you may find it a little bit too painful. Once you've received the desired results, you can completely stop this procedure. You don't need to do this treatment anymore. Your pigmentation and your scarring won't miraculously return to the skin. Once it's gone, it's gone. The side effects to this though, infection is a massive issue, which is why I recommend this particular device with the disposable cartridges. But there are going to be a lot of people that won't be able to do this treatment. So anybody that suffers with keloid scarring and you will know if that is you, definitely do not recommend this for you. Also, if you have any specific blood disorders, if you have eczema, there's a whole list of contraindications with this treatment. So I would definitely recommend, again, if you do have any medical issues to consult your doctor before you buy this piece of kit. The derma rollers are relatively relatively inexpensive. You can pick one of those up for as little as £10. However, I don't think they're as good for your skin as a derma pen. This is going to be best for somebody that is wanting to fight pigmentation or has quite a lot of acne scarring on their skin. You cannot use this if you have active acne. You can use it around the active acne, but you cannot use it over the top. The negatives to this treatment, well, it's invasive. That invasive procedure can open you up to bacteria and infection so you have to make sure that everything is incredibly clean including your hands and any surfaces around you whilst you're doing the treatment. Let's move on to those devices that specifically target fine lines and wrinkles. Firstly let's have a little look at Radio Frequency and Current Body have just released their very own branded Radio Frequency device which is excellent and is really comfortable to use. Radio Frequency devices omit an energy that's measured in wavelengths that has the capacity to produce heat. This heat then penetrates the deeper layers of the skin, inducing new collagen and elastin production and encouraging cell turnover, thus reducing wrinkles, fine lines and also sagging skin. Because of the way the devices look, a lot of people mistake radio frequency devices for microcurrent devices and there's a big difference. So the difference between microcurrent and radio frequency is that microcurrent stimulates the facial muscles, tightening the muscle by mimicking the body's natural process, whereas radio frequency tightens the skin. It greatly improves collagen and elastin production by producing a supervised heat injury to provoke a reaction from the body resulting in plumper, smoother skin with less fine lines and wrinkles. The treatment takes five minutes per treated area. So a full face is going to take you 70 minutes to complete. So even though this is a long time to be doing one treatment, you're actually having to do the treatment less throughout the week. So one to two sessions per week for the first eight weeks, and then one session per four to eight weeks for maintenance. There's three intensity settings on the current body radio frequency device. I've tried them all and they're warm but not painful for me. I can definitely manage all three settings. They do advise that you start on the first setting and work your way up to the third setting if you can manage it. You will see some subtle results immediately but it will build slowly over time. After six weeks you may see more significant improvements but for some people it may take longer. 
Because radio frequency devices induce collagen and elastin production, after a number of months you may feel like you've got the desired effect and you want to discontinue use. What you need to understand is, although you won't notice an immediate decline if you stop using the device, as we age our bodies naturally slow down on its natural production of collagen and elastin. So it's always a good idea to at least keep up with the maintenance program, doing one treatment every four four to eight weeks. The side effects, you may see a little bit of redness, but this does reduce quite quickly. For some, it may take a little bit longer than others. And the device price is £299, which is a lot more affordable than some of the other products I've spoken about in this video already, but it's still a hefty chunk. This is going to be best for people who are specifically wanting to target their problem areas, those specific fine lines and wrinkles or any sagging, crepey skin that they have on their face or their neck. The negatives to the radio frequency device, well, the main one for me is the length of time that it takes to do one full treatment. 70 minutes, if you are wanting to target every single area on the face and neck, is a long time to be doing little circular movements and up and down movements with your arm, especially if you have no upper body strength like me. After about 15, 20 minutes, you start to ache a little bit and have to switch hands. The one good thing, though, is that you don't need to be looking in a mirror to do this. Once you've got the knack of it, you can do it in front of the TV, so I suppose if you pop a film on, the time goes quite quickly. You also need a special gel for the radio frequency device to work properly. The most inexpensive one I've found is actually from the Current Body website, so I will link it in the description box for you. This isn't one of those gels that you can then massage into your skin after you've finished the treatment. This is one of those gels that's actually quite thick, so you will need to wash it off after the treatment's completed. One last major positive for me on radio frequency is you can use the radio frequency devices alongside your other technologies as well. So if you have multiple devices, there are no contraindications to it. You can use radio frequency alongside microcurrent and nanocurrent, and you can also use it alongside LED as well. In fact, there is a specific device that teams all of those technologies together. I haven't tried this myself, so if you wanna give it a go, please please let me know how you get on. But the name of it is the Dr. Arivo Zeus 2 device. And yeah, it, it has pretty much everything in there. The next products in the decreasing fine lines and wrinkles category goes to Nera and also Nera Pro. Now I haven't tried Nera Pro, but I am gonna mention it in this video. It's a larger version of the original Nera, so we'll do other areas on the face as well. So the original Nera device is a non-fractional laser that's primarily to be used around that delicate eye area. So within the tear trough all the way to the corner of the eye and you can also use it above the eye as well to try and lift any hooded lid. You can use the Nera device on other areas of the skin as well, but because the nozzle is relatively small, it's going to take you quite a long time. So how the Nera device works is that the laser heats up the dermis of the skin to stimulate natural collagen production, which then plumps the skin, smooths out wrinkles, firms the skin, and like I said, can even lift hooded eyes. It is a similar process to radio frequency, but it's completely different technology. The treatment will take you two minutes per eye, obviously longer if you are going to be doing other areas of the skin as well. And you need to be doing this treatment every single day. So although it's a relatively short amount of time to actually put towards this, you are going to have to be quite dedicated. It does say on the Nero website that this is a painless procedure. I don't find that it is. I do find it quite painful in certain areas, especially closer to the nose area. It gets more painful there than it does out towards the outer corner of the eye for me. There are five intensity levels to choose from and you should always choose the one that you find most tolerable. I can completely tolerate level three in all areas of my face, but some areas I can boost it up to level five. The sensation for me is like having a rubber band flicked against your skin. It's that stinging, hot sensation, but it's not completely unbearable. For me, you see results in around about three to four months. I don't think you're going to see major results before that. Some people get significant results, other people's are more subtle. 
The results do fade over time as collagen depletes naturally in the skin, but you're not going to notice a massive decline immediately like you would with some of the products that I featured earlier on in this video. It's going to be a more gradual decline, but I would definitely recommend that you keep up with those maintenance treatments anyway. For side effects, you can experience some redness. You can also experience a little bit of soreness. I definitely got more dryness underneath my eyes until my skin turned over and then that was much, much better after a couple of months. But definitely for the first month or so, I did experience that dryness underneath the eye area. The original Nera device is £320. It is always on offer. Please do not pay that amount of money for this device. Always hunt for a discount account code and I'll link mine below for you if you're wanting to give this a go. The original Nero device is the one specifically for the eye area that's going to take you two minutes per eye but they also now do a Nero Pro which is a wider nozzle for the rest of the face and that's going to take you three minutes to do the rest of the face and also costs £320. The Nero devices are going to be best for those people who want to target specific wrinkles, not necessarily the entire skin. And it definitely did work for me. It's also going to be best for those people that don't have a lot of time to dedicate to their skin on a daily basis. So for those of you that don't want to do the 70 minutes every single week for radio frequency, this may be a better alternative for you, even though you have to do this every single day. It's for a limited amount of time. The negatives for both Nero devices, it might not be time consuming, but it's still a commitment having to use this every single day of the week. It's also quite painful. I don't look forward to using this device like I look forward to using my radio frequency devices or some of the other things that I have in this video. And uh, it's also expensive, especially if you're wanting both devices. Okay, let's move on to those devices that do a lot of the things that we've been talking about. Those devices that will decrease pigmentation, that will decrease scarring, that will target and decrease fine lines and wrinkles, and will also so smooth skin texture all in one device. So you all knew that this treatment was going to be included at some point within this video because I've spoken about it a lot on my channel and if you've heard me wax on about this a lot please feel free to move on to the next device. However, LED is my favourite treatment. I just think it is superb, it is phenomenal. The results that you get for the time that it takes per treatment are just out of this world. So there are masks, there are aprons, there are visors, there are plugs, there are panels. Each one of those devices are going to suit differing areas. If you want to treat the whole body, a panel is going to be the best way of you getting the results in the quickest amount of time. Whereas if you only want to treat the lip area, one of the lip effectors is all you're going to need. I personally love my LED mask and my LED neck and deck perfector, but if I could afford it, I would have the LED panels and I would bathe in it every single day. I love LED that much. So all of the current body devices include red light and infrared light to energize the cell's mitochondria, giving them and the fibroblasts a boost, which then stimulates stronger collagen and elastin growth. This in turn will soften fine lines and wrinkles, reduce inflammation, smooth texture and crepiness, fade pigmentation. It tones, it hydrates, and it gives you that youthful glow. Each treatment lasts 10 minutes and you need to be using these three to seven times a week. These are hands-free, so although you're using them for 10 minutes, you can be getting on with other things. Obviously, that doesn't include the panel. The panel, you do have to sit or lay whilst you're having the treatment. There is zero pain with this treatment with maximum benefits. You see results in around about two to three months and there's no need for any special gels or cream. Although I do like to use the Maysama serum because it's proven to increase the efficacy and speed up the results. 
Like with a lot of the other treatments that I've mentioned in this video, you are best to use this continuously without having a break once you've hit your desired goal. If you are using the LED devices primarily to reduce pigmentation on your skin and the pigmentation has disappeared and your skin is much more of an even tone, that pigmentation is not going to return if you stop using your devices. Although you can get sun damage over time, which will then create more pigmentation on your skin, which is why I always recommend that you continue use. So there are some side effects with this that you can get. I personally haven't had any of these, but I know my mum's had a couple, so you can get a little bit of redness, which my mum has experienced. You can also get a rash. Some people's rash isn't itchy at all, some people's is, and you can also get hives. If you get hives, obviously this treatment is not going to be for you, but redness and a little rash goes down pretty quickly, so that shouldn't be an issue unless you're finding it uncomfortable. So the the cost of these is going to be different depending on which one you go for. The most inexpensive one is the Lip Perfector at £149. I personally wouldn't buy this unless you can afford to buy multiple devices. Very few people only have their problem area as around their lips. However, if that is you, then the Lip Perfector may be perfect for you. I just personally prefer to treat a larger area and get more for my money. The most expensive one on the current body website is the Dermalux Flex MD panel. This one's going to set you back £1,895, which is rather pricey, but it is quite a big device and you are going to be able to treat the body with this as well as the face. The LED devices are going to be best for those people wanting to treat multiple concerns with one treatment and one device. So those people wanting to treat scarring, acne, pigmentation, age spots, crepiness, skin texture, fine lines, wrinkles. If you are wanting to treat more than one of those, then these devices, for me personally anyway, are definitely worth the investment. The negatives of the LED devices. Well, firstly, the price. Obviously, depending on which device you go for, the price differs, but it's still an investment regardless of which one you go for. But also, and I'm talking mostly about the Dermalux Flex MD panel here, it's quite a big device and although it folds flat, not a lot of people have the storage to spare. So that to me is a slight issue, but I would find the room. <laughs> I would seriously find the room. So the last device I want to put in this video is actually a really interesting one and I've only been using this since Christmas of 2022, but I love it and it has so many health benefits I wanted to feature it in this video. It also does other things as well, like gives you that body glow. This is a body product, not a face product. This is the higher dose V4 infrared sauna blanket and although it says it's a blanket, this is more like a sleeping bag. It gives all the body benefits of using a sauna, but in the comfort of your own home. So the sauna blanket uses infrared heat, which boosts your circulation, boosts lymphatic drainage and aids that full body detox, healing the body from the inside out. It gives you refreshed, more radiant skin, soothing, aching muscles post-workout. So if you are heavily into exercise, this may be right up your street. It also promotes a deeper sleep whilst increasing your body heat to burn calories. You need to use this two to three times a week, for 30 to 45 minutes each session. I used it for 40 minutes last night and I was glowing by the time I got out of it. And then I get straight into a lukewarm bath to just refresh my skin. Again, there is no pain with this treatment whatsoever. You do feel instantly better once you get out of the sauna blanket. And there are so many body benefits as well as health benefits with continuous use over time. This is one of those products that you can use two to three times a week to boost your circulation and your lymphatic drainage and detox your body. However, if you want to save it for those occasions post-workout or you just want to use it as and when you need it, you totally can do that as well.
So for side effects, there are a list of contraindications on the website and the list is quite a long one. I definitely recommend that you check that out before you purchase one of these devices because it would be such a shame to waste your money. And again, if you do have any medical conditions, consult your doctor just to check that you're okay entering a sauna before you purchase. The price of the sauna blanket is £539, which is one of the most expensive pieces of kit that I've talked about in this video so far. However, it's not going to suit everybody. Not everybody is going to, one, like this, two, have the storage facilities enabled to store this away when they're not using it, and three, have the budget for it. This is going to be best for those people wanting to full body detox on a regular basis, those that want to boost circulation, boost lymphatic drainage, but also those people that are super active and often get those little muscle knots and muscle aches, which can be relieved over time with continuous use of the sauna blanket. There are a couple of negatives for the sauna blanket and I'm not just talking about that initial cost, which I know is a lot and will put a lot of people off immediately. If you are an incredibly tall person, and I'm talking over six foot five really, my husband is six foot four, six foot five, I really should know that, but he's been using the sauna blanket and fits perfectly inside, although his toes are right up against the bottom. So if you are over six foot five, you may struggle to get your whole body within the blanket all the way up to your neck. And if you're wanting a full body detox, if you're wanting to get full advantage of the sauna blanket, you are really supposed to be all the way up to here within the blanket to get the best effects out of it. Also, if you struggle to get comfortable whilst laying down, that may also be an issue for you because you do have to use the device whilst laid down and you are in it for 30 to 40 minutes. The storage of this product is also an issue. It is incredibly bulky. And again, not a lot of people have that much space to make the piece of equipment accessible enough so that you're going to use it enough to get your money out of it. And also there are certain materials that you can't put this on. So any flammable materials is a big no-no. If you have a memory foam mattress, you can't lay it on top of the memory foam mattress. Luckily, my mattress is not a memory foam one, so I lay this directly on the top of my bed and have no issues. You also have to wear clothing whilst you're in the sauna blanket, and it's also advisable to lay on a towel as well for extra cushioning, just to make it a little bit more comfortable. Because it's a sauna and because you're wearing clothing, you do have to do an excessive amount of washing. And uh, that is a negative for me. My washing basket is piled high with clothing that I've worn whilst I've been in the sauna blanket. And I've only got it on for 40 minutes. So if you are like me and you don't like washing your clothes on a daily basis, then you're either going to have to buy more clothes to wear in the sauna blanket, which is an extra cost, or do more washing. So that's it for this video. I really hope you found it helpful. I'm hoping there is something for everybody's needs within this video and you have a clearer idea of what is involved with each piece of equipment. Hopefully I've enabled you to eke out the ones that are definite no-goes and shine light on the ones that you may enjoy. Do let me know what you've thought about this video in the comment section. Do you have any of these devices already? Are they your ride or dies? Do you not use them as regularly as you would like to? Do you wish you'd not bought them at all? Please share your knowledge and experiences with the rest of the pack. Also, please don't forget to check out the Current Body website and all the links in the description box. Also, please don't forget to like and subscribe and I hope to see you all in the next one. Bye everyone.